Hey everyone, today we're talking about step entry mode for MIDI in Harrison Mixbus and Mixbus 32C. I use this for creating basic drum backing tracks, I use it for electronic music, I use it for orchestral composition, all sorts of things, so let's go and check it out. Okay, so I'm over at Harrison Mixbus and I've got a track set up here. There are three layers of MIDI and a few tracks of audio. Let's have a quick listen. <laughs> So I'm going to recreate that 16th note pulsing bass line pattern using the step entry method. I just want to make sure the track I'm working on has MIDI input enabled and the input port is selected. Then I right click on the record arm button and click step entry. Now a window pops up, it looks complicated but don't worry, it's pretty simple really. I want to make sure that I have the correct note duration selected, so I've got 16th notes selected here and I just simply start clicking. This then of course enters each of the notes I've pressed in 16th notes. Really simple. If you're lucky enough to have a MIDI keyboard to the side of you like I do, you can always play these in, which is kind of good because it gives you velocity levels as well. So I'm going to finish off this pattern playing it in on the keyboard. <laughs> Okay, so that's complete. I just close the step entry window and the track comes off record arm. So let's have a listen and see what we've got. So that's how you can use the step entry function to enter complex arpeggios, ostinatos, all sorts of things like that, even drum tracks. If you want to know more about MIDI in Harrison Mixbus and Mixbus 32C or have a go on the free demo, get yourselves over to harrisonconsoles.com and I will see you all next time.